Hey there, everybody. How you doing? I am Francis, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Return to Hydean. Last episode, we collected all of the crystals, and we got the silver arrows. We now have everything we need to take on Ganon. But before we do that, I'm going to better my chances by going to a secret temple. Now, if you guys remember, we started going this way uh, when we finished the Dark Temple, but we kind of aborted that and went back because we didn't have everything we needed. So, uh, I did go through the Dark Temple and get to the uh, second entrance while I was off camera. So, uh, let's get going, shall we? Do, 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 do. I love the music, by the way. I really do. Also, I did get that piece of heart now, but there's uh, no way back up here and I'll have to go uh, around again. That's not really something I really want to do, so... Uh, we'll leave that and I'll get off camera. And that piece of heart we could also get somehow. Uh, I'm not sure. All I know is uh, we can't get it from here. But that's okay. Because we are on a mission. A mission to go to a secret temple, which, uh... It is a secret temple. It is completely optional. It does help to get it. But you don't need it. You, you really could just uh, go straight into Hyrule Castle and take on Ganon out. That's something you really want to do. But yeah, last time we turned back because uh, we couldn't go this way because uh, we couldn't get past this grass. Well, now we can. So we can now do that. And if we want to go to the castle, we can just hook shot down that way, but... We don't want to right now. Instead, we want to go down this way. And well, we're going on down here. To a completely new area I've never been to before. Yeah, those guys shoot three in a row, so... Be mindful of that. Oh, I need to be up there, okay. This place I really actually do enjoy navigating. Oh, right. Gotta go this way because I can't shoot over rocks either. That's a lot of dudes. Alright. Ow. There we go. Those guys are annoying when you do like uh, like the three heart, no, well not three heart, but uh, minimum heart, uh, don't take any damage, uh, don't ever game over, yeah that, that annoying uh, thing. The rules for some of the extra ways to play this game are absolutely absurd. Like yeah, yeah, don't die is uh, one of them for like the ultra rank thing. And you can't get any upgrades, so the uh, pendants we began, forget about that. Where we're going now, forget about that, because it uh, counts as upgrading your sword, and that's not something you want to do. It it's some very, very ridiculous rules to basically make it as hard as possible, just for really the sake of being hard. I'm not really all for that, you know? I mean, I have tried it before, but I feel miserably, and <laughs> I'm not ready to try again. There we go. It's taking us a while to get to- Oh my god, that's- Nope, that's not by all of them. Yeah, we can just run past that. Alright, there is the secret file temple and... When we want to go back, uh, that's the way back to the castle town. Just going through that, uh... Glow up above wall, which we'll do when we're done here. But yeah! The Hidden Temple, here rests the Sword of Evil Spain, the Master Sword. So this is where Zelda hid it after we gave it back to her. Good thing she didn't leave it in a castle. And this temple... I remember this one was kind of hard. But yeah, it's optional, but as you know, since we're going for the Master Sword, it does help to have. And yeah, that's pretty much all, all it is. It's one floor. And it's pretty much just a gauntlet, like uh, defeat the enemies, go to the next room type of deal. It's pretty straightforward, I actually enjoy it here. 
I don't know what the boss is, though. I'm sure that'll be a fun time, though, when we get to it. I like the music here. I know it's from another game. Like, most of the music in this. I just wish I knew where this piece of music came from. I mean, I love it. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna take anything away from it. It's, it's kind of bugging me to not remember what game it's from. Like, I feel like I've heard it before. But it is pretty cool. Alright, now I got another key. And we'll go through here then. Hello! Ow. Yeah! Uh, let's put my hood shot on so I don't have to get uh, too close to fight things. Because their pitchforks are hurting a lot. Ah, there we go. That's a lot of dudes! That's a lot of dudes, my dude! Alright, cool. Sounds like a door opened, so I ha did have to fight them. Alright, we got the boss key. Time to take on big bad boss of this uh, place. And if we got low on health, remember we do have we do have potions. And this leads straight to the boss. Alright, who are you? Oh, it's just the Hell Master King? Okay. You know what? I can do this with my, my just my sword. Oh dear, I'm gonna die. There we go. And yeah, there's no crystal, but there is the Master Sword. Yeah! And that will recover our health, and now... Now we can go into Hyrule Castle, so let's uh, go do this, shall we? This hidden temple didn't take me that long. It never really does. It's just, uh... It's very straightforward. And you guys know why I put the bombs on, because they're required. Or they're not required, we could go back the way we came. But it is much faster to go this way. So, bomb! Put shot on, I'll uh, probably need it. There we go. Alright. And at the Master Sword, we can beat ghosts now. Although we could also kill them with silver arrows. But yeah, the Master Sword can take care of them too, which is pretty cool. Nice. Oh, that's the way back here. Okay. We're back in the land of the dead. Well, let's go straight to the castle. Not waste any time. Actually, we're gonna waste time. We're gonna get a uh, piece of the heart for the monsters we have killed on the way. Hello. One enemy? Okay, I'm, I'm sure one enemy. I, I didn't see that coming. Because we practically, you know, killed everything. Alright, I'm ready. I'm coming for you again. Let's go! Right into the castle. Hyrule Castle. And yeah, the guards have gone evil. As, you know, always, they are loyal to whoever the one is who calls themselves king. Even if the king is, uh, not the real king. Kind of strange how fast, you know, they swear allegiance to Ganon, you know. Alright, got a small key. Let's go in here. Hello, blue guard. Thank you for the arrows. Oh, now. Eh, eh, eh. Our small key. Oh boy, I'm surrounded. There we go. Eh, eh, eh. There we go. Got a compass. That's always nice. I was hoping Master Sword could break these pots, but alas, it cannot. I am still stuck with the curse of picking things up to smash them. All 
Cool. And there's that. It's, uh, you know, we need to go down the R pathway because it's blocked by red walls. Or it is blocked by blue walls. Alright. We're in. Ow. <laughs> hammer, hammer, boom, boom. Oh, we haven't missed anything yet, which is good news. Go down here. And once again, we have to find a switch. Under one of these things. Of course, it's gonna be the last one I check. Now, just take me straight back here. This is good to know, I guess. It's good to have a way back. Alright. Ow. Eh. Going downstairs. What's going on down here? Oh boy. Now, those uh, purple fireballs, they had an interesting effect in, uh... In Oni Link Begins. They filled up a, They didn't hurt your health, but they filled up a certain meter that you never want to fill. And this room I remember having troubles with, and I am dying. And I don't want to die, so... I'm gonna drink myself a potion. Wow, those things take a lot of health away. Holy hell! My god, I don't like those, uh, purple balls. Not one bit. Hello. Uh, at least the castle town is not too far from the castle, right? So I can always go there. If it is where we need it, which it might be. Okay, go in here. Nope, not fun. You don't have to. Not going to bark. I do not have the boss key, and I think this guy might have it. Well, he's got a small key, which is actually the key I need, alright. Hey, little Zelda. Uh, I'm gonna have to drink my blue potion. I really don't want to, but I kinda have to. Hello. Congratulations, Link. You have succeeded in saving me. Let's find game quickly. We have to reclaim the Triforce. Yeah, Zelda's gonna follow you now, but here's the thing. If you go too far ahead, you'll see the stops. See the stops. So you gotta move slowly and... Yeah, this does get annoying. Because she has to keep up with you. And if you go too fast, she just stops and is like, Link, where'd you go? I'm lost without you. But as long as she can see you and she can move and you go through a door, she will follow you through the, do through the door. Like so. I wish I didn't have to move so slowly, though! Boss key! Let's go! I like how the door just automatically opened for us. Alright. Slowly making our way back. Check! Alright. And if you die, yeah, you have to go uh, find Zelda again. Like, you have to go through to the basement and rescue her again and everything. So don't die! For the love of God, don't die! Alright. And yet, yeah, Renarda stop and take breaks too because Zelda has to keep up, you know. She cannot be left behind. There we go. And now we have to go through the middle door. So now we have Zelda with us, we can. Ow. Come on, Zelda. This way. I am dying. Is something I shouldn't be doing, you know? 
Cut this. Yes, slowly walk, girl. Could you be any slower? The secret passage behind the throne room leads to Ganon. Hurry up. Where do you think we're going? I just wanted to see if you say anything. Like, got anything to say for yourself for being slow? And now I can't move. God damn it, Zelda. We are very near. Follow me. Okay. Well, she just went in without us. She's brave. She's gonna take on Ganon on her own. Ganon is just behind that door. I will cure your wounds. Oh, I thank you. I don't have any potions, so I don't have much confidence in this, but let's go. I'm gonna die. Because these purple balls do way too much damage. Yep, okay. Who didn't see that coming? Let's grab some potions so we can actually do this, you know. And be as reckless as possible. But with both Zelda now, I can go as fast as I want. Wee hee! Look at me go. Alright. Zelda on the roof watching me walk by is probably like, Link, where are you going? Get in this way. Link, are you coming back? Thank you. Red potions. And I'm gonna buy some arrows from the shop. Thank you. I'm gonna buy some more actually. There we go. Uh, buy some more actually. So yeah, if you didn't get the Master Sword, you would have to damage uh, again using the Silver Arrows. Because your Standard Sword won't work on him. Which is why it's recommended to get the Master Sword, you know, because if you run out arrows, you're going to have a hard time. Thank you for recovering that one heart. I appreciate it, girl. Oh, boy! And there we go! We found a Triforce! At the right time when Link touched the Triforce, monsters disappeared and peace has returned. Then Princess Zelda made a great decision. She touched in turn the Triforce and made her wish. Triforce had always been the original of troubles in the kingdom. Sooner or later, another evil creature would find it. Just when Princess touched the relic, it disappeared from Hyrule forever. Since this day, Hyrule people have lived in peace, without fear of new disasters. Thus, the Legend of Zelda, of the Triforce, and of the Golden Land is achieved. Master Sword is said to rest safely somewhere and to be the last heirloom of Link's quest. And here's the results! It took us 2 hours and 20 minutes and 27 milliseconds. We died 7 times. We got 26 of the 36 pieces of heart. We have 60, 56 of 56 objects. Defeated all kinds of enemies. We beat 45 of 46. Uh, the one we missed, I believe, is the Wall Master. And you complete the game with 92% uh, complete. Congratulations, Rank Zelda fan. And I'll show you what I meant about these other records. There's a 100% rank, which I have gone before. There's an ultimate rank, which is the one I was telling you about. Complete the game without dying. Yikes. With 10 hearts at the very most. So really only just, uh, you know, getting the extra heart for the bosses. No piece of heart, no heart containers, anything like that. Without talking to the Great Fairy, so you can't get any uh, pendants. Without buying bottles and without taking a shield. So you take a lot of damage. And no bottles, yikes. And there's a speed rank, which is less than two hours, which two hours is uh, what we took, you know. But yeah, here you go. That And that is the end of our adventure. So this was uh, The Legend of Zelda Return to Hiding. I didn't expect on today being the finale, but it was. I really hope you guys have enjoyed this. Thank you so much for joining me. And I will see you guys next time when we begin. Ani Ning begins. See you guys then. Thank you for joining me. Have a nice day. Bye, everybody.